Oh, of course. Um, Starlight on Nash. Absolutely. I have all these Starlights here. I'll end up giving them the characters for the boss fight. You know, Jessica use Heal Lightning. I have to use a Starlight on either Luna or Jessica, depending. I have so many, and also I'm kind of loaded, so I can like buy money, buy stuff really easily. Get a save just cuz. I just make it a habit to save often in this game. There's a chest up there. Of course! Of course it's confusion! I have to just open it because what if it's something good? Okay, see, that that's a good one. That's a good chest to get. That's why I gotta keep opening them. But again, the, uh, the confusion one is like the least detrimental. I'm gonna sword dance here. And give a heal here. And you're gonna thunder bomb, and then you are going to do something. Probably just normal attack. Check this out. Check this out. My thunder bomb. The move. The only move I have so far. Good ninety-one. Hopefully, the game can give me at least like fifty experience with this one. I need the XP rate for Nash. Actually, no, Nash, you're gonna fire King. I guess for the boss, Nash can always use fire. Like, depending what works better, Thunder Bomb or Fire King. Thunder Bomb does better if it's actually their weakness. The sprites in this game are really good, I agree. I like the sprites. Lunar has really nice sprites. It's got a nice charm. The charm to it is so good. The sprites are very, very nice. Very, very cute. Cutesy art style, I like it. It's cutesy while not being too cutesy, if that makes sense. Die. 56. It did pass the threshold. I wanted more than 50. And we did get more than 50. Hey, Luna. How's it going? Please? Of course! Of course! Two of you? That's scary. Check this out. Check this out. Die. Jessica gets two attacks at some point. I remember her getting a second attack at some point. Because I'm thinking to myself, like, yeah, her one attack does almost as much as Alex's double attack, but I'm pretty sure she gets a double attack at some point. You're just gonna kill here. And you are gonna attack. You are going to do this. And you're gonna do something. Check this out. Thunder Bomb is just so tempting to not do. Oh wow, that killed no one, huh? That's interesting. This is where Alex's Cascade Song buff comes in handy. What's this thing called? Monocrop. Okay. I thought I saw something a lot worse there. I was gonna have to have a serious talk with work in designs. This is still active. I 
a good time to do a healing nut. Also, I'm going to use both of these. We have so much money. Hey! Stupid confusion thing. Wear off, please. Thank you. This is place so big. Please. Okay, a fresh ring. Finally a chest that's not a trap. What does the fresh ring do? Prevents conditions. Nice. I think Alex is the most viable party member for that. If not Alex, then like Jessica. But I, even then, I think Alex is the best one for that. Where that tent is the right way. You want to throw hands? All right, we're going to throw hands. I was going to let you live. You know, I see an opportunity. I have to go for it. What's a, what's using a starlight on Alex gonna do? I'll do it. No big deal. Die to die to die. I also always forget that Nash is the fastest character. Which is insane. It's interesting. It's like weird to me. Alright, we go to that tent and that should be the boss fight? I don't know if that's the boss fight or if that's like the cue for like, hey, the boss is coming up. This stupid thing is gonna catch me, I know it is. Of course, of course it's confusion. If I got to move away in time, I probably- ah, I probably wouldn't have gotten away because it would have caught me eventually. You know what? Can I- can I, like, opt out? That's 10 MP worth, but still, can I opt out? Did that make him disappear because they ran away? Okay, it counts as me killing the enemy. That's what I thought. Okay, I don't know if that's just the fake Dragon Master. I don't know. Here is what we're going to do. I'm gonna save the game here. Be prepared, and if they do give me a heal, I will load. One for Alex. I think just one for everyone but Jessica, right? Luna might need two. No, Luna probably only needs... One. I'll probably have, like, a few in the inventory just in case. Yeah. Try this. I'll just buy more starlets when we're back in town. Well, no, we don't. We don't want to save. We want to see what happens here. Hey, you brats! What business do you have bothering me, the Great Dragon Master Zok? How did you battle through the swamp monster to find me? Okay, yeah, I think this is just a boss fight. What? You've come here to take me down? Ha <laughs> How delightful! How dare you invade the home of the protector of Althena and doubt his ability to smite you? If you're the real Dragon Master, you must have met the four dragons, right? What are their colors? You insult me, brat. Of course I've met the four dragons. White dragon, red dragon, the, uh, mauve dragon, and the teal dragon. Yeah, dude, you got classic colors like red and white. Then we're gonna throw in, like, mauve and teal. Totally. Now, do you doubt that I'm the true Dragon Master, children? No. Yes. Alex, this guy's even more full of it than Nash. Hey. That's quite enough of your verbal abuse, brats. You have left me no choice but to teach you a lesson. Witness my command of the dragons of Land Island and regret forever your infernal curiosity. I don't 
remember this boss fight. Like, legitimately, I don't remember it. Okay, I kind of do now. I still don't really remember it, but... Let's do a sword dance. You do a cascade song. We can try thunder and see how that does. Then you're going to use heal light me on Nash, I think. Actually, you know what? Go for a calm. Check this out. Probably should have made sure we were healed before this. Yeah, okay. Thunder is your weakness. Fire might do a little bit less. Although when you run out of thunder bombs, I'll probably have to use fire cane. Bum 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 bum. Twenty four damage. Oh, you get two attacks. Interesting. Three attacks. Okay, then calm down. You know what to do. I'm gonna actually have you heal song so Jessica can get some chip damage on it. See how much it does. It should do a good amount. Because Luna is almost out of MP, so then Jessica can take control of healing. Oh, nice 200. Good old 200. You can cure conditions too, of course. You do this again. Check this out. 28 is not worth it, but it's better than nothing. And Nash will just be spamming Thunder Bomb until he runs out, and then we just switch over to Fire King. That is this fight. I guess I could have gave. Oh, that's scary. So now we gotta like use Calm Lightning. I have enough for a Tranquil Song, but still, I'm gonna have Jessica Calm Lightning. Do that just for a boost. Check this out. Bum, bum, bum. Athena, lend me your power! 40, good 40. Just don't go for the Grand Slam move again, because that might be the end. Hence why I'm giving Jessica the extra healing. Okay, throwing fire. This is new. Have your normal attack. Put you to the front so you're not so close to everyone. And then... I think I am going to Cascade Song you. And you'll heal Nash. Check this out. And I have that starlight I can use on anyone. Athena, lend me your power. Probably should save it for Alex. Even though Alex still has like two or three sword dances left, but I think saving it for Alex is a smart call. I probably should have put another starfall in someone's inventory. But yeah, now that only hits Alex now, which is good. Because he's not close to everyone. Back to sword dancing. I have this starlight, but the question is, who do I use it on? Alex will probably need it. We're gonna thunder bomb, and then what you do is like. I mean, I cascaded song. I should at least take advantage, but also that could put you in danger. Yeah, do this for now. Check this and we'll kind of see how much damage it does, and then I'll be like, yeah, it's probably not worth having Jessica attack. Yeah. You don't always go for the press move, though. Yeah, now you're going for this. Just split up attacks. Ow. If I attack from the back, I'll do more damage.
I think healing you is more important than Luna herself, to be honest. And then you do that. Check this out. Although maybe I should have switched that because Jessica is faster. Alfina, lend me your power. Bum, 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 bum. Never mind, it all worked out. I think everyone's faster than the big frog. Thank you, Null. Now I will... You can't change equipment mid-battle, can you? No, but that'd be really cool if you could. Sword dance? You can't do anything? Really? Just defend for now? You do this, and then you should heal Nash. Check this out. I still have that Starlight, which I'm considering just using on Alex, because Alex is doing the most damage by far. Yeah, using it on Alex is probably like the way I win here because we still have Jessica to heal. It's too bad I didn't get to attack with Jessica with Cascade Song, but you know how it is. I also have this herb. Here, you're going to use a Starlight on Alex. You're going to keep Thunder Bombing until you're out, and then I think I'm just going to Calm Lightning here. Check this out. Even if it's a little risky. Bum, 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 bum. That's gonna kill Nash. Now it's time to get him up. I'm gonna move you back here. Because you're basically on healing duty. Until you run out. A nice dodge. <laughs> nice five. spread out here you being near Nash is a little scary check this out but what I just used with you Did I just go AI I might have okay I went AI and she chose to use calm lightning which was not the smart move okay it died doesn't matter <laughs> I win 600 experience yo we're level 17 already the bosses really give you a lot in Lunar 1. Like, the bosses give you, like, one level up sometimes. Did everyone just level up? I hope Nash did. Nash needs the levels. Yeah, everyone just leveled up here. Also, Nash got something. It's probably like a poison spell. I remember Nash getting some negative status effect stuff or something. My dragon! What have you done to my cute little dragon? That was not a dragon. That's not a dragon, pal. Unlike you, we've seen the real thing. That was a swamp monster called a frog lizard. And you're lucky he didn't eat you for breakfast. Really? Uh, I guess you kids saved my life, didn't you? You mean spared your life? You're lucky I didn't slay you along with your pathetic little reptile. And how dare you make the villagers of land suffer to fuel your ego. You're right, I deserve whatever punishment I get. When I learned magic, I let it go to my head, and I used it to get what I wanted. I abused that power. When I came here and found what I thought was a dragon, I decided to have some fun with the villagers. I promise us you won't use magic for any evil anymore. I promise. I'm going back home and bending my ways. Yeah, I don't believe you. I'll need some proof on that. Thank you for bringing me to my senses. Thank you so much. I'll be good. You'll see. You'll see. Words. Well, we can... Is there a chest back here? If not, then I'm just going to drag him fly wing out of here. We 
you can go buy some more starlights, but also we should be careful because I want to buy equipment too, and we gotta save up for equipment. That went really well. This is where, this is definitely where the difficulty, like, picks up. There is still, like, uh, I think there's another part coming up that I remember being hard. But other than that, like, this is, like, where the difficulty gets a little, like, balanced with more party members and stuff. Ah, what a relief. You guys did better than I expected. Hello again. Facia, what are you doing all the way out here? Visitors to the shrine were constantly speaking of a new Dragon Master in the region, so I took it upon myself to investigate the matter. He was a fake, even worse, a fish thief. So we took care of him for you, didn't we, Alex? I was so pleased that a new Dragon Master had been born, and now he turns out to be a common criminal. It's certainly disheartening. I pray the rumors of a magic emperor turn out to be spurious as well. Hmm? I must return to the shrine with the bad news. Good luck in your journeys, Alex. Hey, who was that? Who was that? That was Facia, the leader of Althena's shrine. You know, the place where you study magic? Or should I say, the place where you're supposed to be studying magic? Oh, hush up. What I was about to say before Nash's sad attempt at a slam is that I've never heard about this Facia woman. What do you mean, Jessica? I mean, there isn't anyone named Facia at the shrine. At least not before I left on this little adventure a few weeks ago. What? But everyone at the shrine seemed to know who she was. Hmm, that's strange. I better check it out. Alex, Luna, Null, perhaps we can meet again on a future adventure. Until then, so long. And take care of yourself, Nash. He's out. Wait. And she's gone. What an impertinent girl. Nothing at all like Mia. I like them both, and I think Nash does too. Haha. <laughs> I like them both too, but Mia's the best girl. I'm still confused by what she said about Facia. There's no way Jessica could live at the shrine and not know who she is. 